My father's dead. Murdered in Kowloon. He always told me that this life, the life of a gangster, can be short. Even for a boss. Most of the family he died while meditating at a temple. The truth is, he was worshipping other gods. His two favorites. Pharmaceutical grade coke and cheap woman. Regardless, I have sworn on his grave to find those responsible to avenge him. I did this mostly so as to guarantee my inheritance, also because the old man was a good guy. For a philandering drug adult murder. Julian, his sword, generations old, has always been in the keeping of the head of the family. Treasure my father invented after winning the sword in the card game. That I've got to deliver the stupid thing to the family's new patriarch, Uncle Wu Kenny Lee. In that great American mil melting pot, Liberty City. The last time I visited Liberty City, I caught crabs off a Swiss tourist. Still, even a pampered little snot like me shouldn't be able to bungle delivering a sword to a moody and power crazy uncle. Well, a penchant of for, for uh, with a penchant for, for exotic pornography and impersonating people out of kung fu films. Sorry for the volume. Sometimes though, even the simplest of jobs don't work out quite the way you expect them to. Mr. Lee, Huang Lee, your uncle sent us to meet you. Oh damn. Fuck! We're being jumped! It's a fucking ambush! Rockstar Games presents a Rockstar Leads production in association with Rockstar North. Grant of Thought of Chinatown Wars. Welcome everybody, this is Beastar47 and today it's going to be a new game edition. But this time it's going to be a new walkthrough on this game. As you see, Grand Theft Auto, Chinatown Wars. And this game, damn. I don't remember, don't really remember this game. I've actually played this on the Nintendo DS and uh, unfortunately it didn't really perform well on the... Uh, Economics, I mean, like it didn't really grab a lot of cash. It sold like on uh, Nintendo DS, uh, PSP, and now it's on iOS as well as uh, other stores uh, for mobile. And uh, I actually bought this game a long time ago, but I didn't even touch it at all. Then I actually raised it because I was like in my other phone. And I didn't really have a lot of uh, a lot of like a space uh, reserved for some games, but still, I. I actually had the game and I tried it a little bit and like now I don't even remember how it is but like whatever right now I'm actually gonna be doing a walkthrough and uh, yeah this is actually gonna be like interesting let's see if it's actually going to go to my it's gonna pump up to my expectations probably yes cuz Rockstar games they always do the one of some of the best games ever Grand Theft Auto Red Dead Redemption Max Payne 3 LA Noir Dang. These games, those games were actually very good. Which is actually why I'm pretty much sure this game is actually going to live up to my expectations of a Rockstar game and to a Grand Theft Auto game. Because this, remember playing the, this game when I was actually little? Yes, I did. And, uh, yeah. I really liked it because it was like my first GTA game. That I ever played on DS uh, and ever played, so yeah, I'm probably sure it's, it's gonna be a good experience as well. This is definitely going to give me back uh, some of the some of the old times. I'm definitely going to remember some of the old times. Yeah. Okay, Genie Bell, Yulian, this is the mission. It's clearly not my day. Definitely not, Lee. You just got like dumped into the war. Tap the vehicle windows to smash it and escape. I'm not doing it. I'm gonna die. Just kidding, I'm gonna do it fast. Okay, when I said fast, I didn't mean that fast. 
Okay, now it's time to swim like you never swam before. Like you never swam before. Like what? Like you never swam before. Man, my grammar is definitely getting fucked. What a place. Beaten up, shot, and nearly drowned. Within minutes of getting here. True. My father would have paid for this kind of fun, but it's never appealed to me. No shit. Who would like to get shot in the head? I better find a car and get over to Uncle Kenny's. And how is he still alive? That's something I'm really, really asking myself. How is he still alive? Get a car. So let's get this shitty car. Oh, the classic screwdriver shit. You can touch the screen to interact with highlighted items. Touch the screwdriver, slide to the ignition lock, then rotate it to force the ignition lock so that you can drive the car. No shit, it's not gonna be for anything else. Like, I'm just gonna put a screwdriver there. I'm just gonna do this. Uh, well, it's already in. Let's go there. Let's go. This is how to steal a car for noobs. Stealing cars 101. People should probably look at that and fuck, like, these arrows, I do not really like them. I do not like their position or anything. Oh, shit! Police pursuit. Well, uh, oh, I just killed a woman. Wasn't really my intention at- Whoa! Okay, from what I remember, the only thing I really remember is that there's actually, like, this, uh, this, uh, body armor thing. So I'm actually going to take it, because, like, I mean, like, why the fuck not? And I'm actually gonna escape and do whatever I want as if I did nothing wrong because I flipped over a car and my car is now smoking And I killed it. Oh weapon 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 Yes, I got I got a weapon get a weapon. Let's get let's get in the car get in the car I'm probably sure that this is like the fastest way to actually get uh, Like ammo and weapons. Well, I just Lost a lot of health with this Let's see this. What does uncle Kenny have to say to us? Or what do we have to say to him? Let's see. Huang, I heard you've been killed. Thank all that is good that you are alive. What happened? I was hoping for a couple of strippers. And a VIP table in the club. Instead I was ambushed, robbed. And left for dead, uncle. Not much of a welcome. Just like your father. A playboy. Not a worker. These are dangerous times, Huang. But we'll find a deal with these killers. Don't know why I'm doing a British accent, like, whatever. Do you have the sword? Do you have Julian? I think the murderer took- the murderers took it. Either that or your useless bodyguard. Don't get snot with me, you little brat. I had promised Julian as a gift to our leader. Sin, 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 or whatever. Sin, Jaume. But have gained me great favor for with him. Perhaps even sealing my position as his replacement when he steps down. Its loss will irreparably damage my standing. My honor is this best merged. What the fuck? Best merged, uncle. It is 2009, not 14.3. No, both of them are wrong. It's 2016 right now. And you're going to give the store away? But it's been in our family for generations. Don't give me that bullshit. Your father won that, your father won that thing in the COD game. As a gift to sin, it would have made me the tried boss here in Liberty City. Huang. Your father was a good man, but he's dead now, and that puts me in charge. I have to do what is best for the family, even if it goes against our traditions and my desires. I have arranged an apartment for you. Rest there for a while. We will speak again soon, once you have both calmed down. Grief can be very unsettling. So can being shot in the head and nearly drowned. Li has a point, Huang has a point, I mean, like, whatever, okay. I'm not, I'm, 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 t I'm staying here with, like, with only one hand, only one gun. That's probably best. There are, like, million cars over here. I don't even know what car is this. I don't even remember. Let's take it. It's like, I mean, why the fuck not? Chavos. Uh, I don't know where the fuck am I going. Oh, Mustang, Mustang. There's a Mustang. There's a Mustang. I'm taking the Mustang. Get the fuck over here, Mustang. There's the Mustang. I will go away from you. Oh, this is my apartment. Liberty Tree. Liberty City. Worst place in America. Again. Dude, that is the best Rockstar humor. Rockstar always does these humors and everything. This is your apartment. Will you a little save gain? You will start. Ah, whatever. What the fuck? Screw this shit. I'm parking my car in that. Ah. What the fuck have I done? Wait. Can I actually press both of them? Ah! 
Okay, these are the burnouts in GTA then. You just do that. And like you actually go and put some flames. I think you can, I think you can burn people. From Wu Kenny Lee. Subject, visit me soon. Nephew. I'm sorry our meeting was a little tense. I miss your father dearly. He was like a brother to me. In fact, he was a brother to me. My grief often gets the better of me. And I find myself acting inappropriately. Please forgive me. Hope you like your apartment, but don't get too comfortable. I need to speak to you about something as soon as possible. Yours, Uncle Kenny. Hey, I've got I've got a uh, message from Badger. Subject: Welcome. Welcome. Thanks for choosing the Badger the Badger Network. Now you are online. You will be able to receive an email on uh, the move. Occasionally, Badger Networks was may send you automated emails detailing special offers and important news. The service may be canceled at any time by calling our subcontinent offices at. On 555 long wait. <laughs> Genius Rockstar, you're explaining very well how how shit some of those lines are. Rest assured that your private details are secure with us and our uh, our arbitrary arbitrary third party advertised badger badger network services. Call charge at only one dollar per second. Yes, only one dollar per second. You can't even call in this game, so fuck it. I'm not even doing anything. Okay, so yeah, that's everything then. Pretty much the best thing that could actually happen. Let me see the budget if uh, I've passed it or not. Maybe to do the second mission. Okay, that's already enough. Yeah, that's enough. All right, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. This is gonna be a, a full walkthrough on GTA Chinatown Wars. So if you want to see more, make sure to tell me that in the comment section down below. Also, make sure to drop a like to this video, comment and subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Oh, uh, and also, tell me if you want this to be uncut or edited. I really need to know because uh, I can do it edited and make it actually funny, or just leave it plain uncut. So yeah, whatever you want. Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Yeah, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye bye.